we're at an exotic car tour down uh, going through Stratus Vineyards. We just stopped off here and we got a number of really cool cars out today. Um, of course, the McLaren, a brand new GT3 RS, new uh, M3 BMW Bentley, uh, an old Testarossa Audi R8, um, and a new C63 AMG as well. So a lot of really cool cars out uh, today for this exotic car tour. Brand new GT3 RS and just picked up by my friend Brad and I'm going to get an opportunity to drive it a little bit later. Awesome. So you're in Sport PDK and you're in um, okay. Sport Exhaust. Awesome. See you there. So remember you got four cars behind you. Yep. So, so I'm going to try to take it easy. Well, just, give, just keep in mind when we turn that we make sure we get everybody. Because they're all following yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. Actually, it feels like my Cayman <laughs> <laughs> right now until it gets up into the power band, but this, it definitely feels a little bit bigger. Yeah. The wing out the back is cool. I, uh, it's beautifully appointed. Brian, you did a nice job. And I, I even like the yellow center uh, piece. Could you have gotten that in a red instead? I can't. No? I tried to on my old car and I couldn't. Because some of them come in red. Yes, the, I know. It's a ones. very specialized thing. So <laughs> now in this motor, you just like, Fourth, we're fine right here, but go to third just to oh, yeah, run just, three. Yeah. yeah, just keep it above yeah. 1500. Yeah, don't lug the engine. No. It has a more mechanical feel to the PDK. It's more like a. Yeah. Well, it's in sport mode too, yeah. so. What we're probably going to do is go up through here. Yeah. Okay. And go along the Wellington now up through all the, okay. um, up the roads. We're kind of just going to do an adventure drive. Yeah, totally. I'm fine with that. I love the seats too. They feel great. Yeah, they're really comfortable. So they're comfortable on like a long drive? They yeah, seem I, to fit me. I yeah, mean, I, I don't think you could be really fat and fit into them. Brad, you just picked this GT3 RS up when? Uh, Wednesday a week ago. Awesome. So, uh, and... Uh, it's eight days, nine days. You've been alone. waiting for this car for how long? Two years. Wow, it does feel wider. It feels a lot bigger, um, but it still feels like a Porsche. So we haven't obviously done anything with it yet, All except right. just pop hut it through at about 50 kilometers an hour. So, uh, <laughs> however, this is one of my most favorite cars on the planet. Out of anything, I think I really like the GT3 RS. Always have. And one thing that I am noticing right now, though, is the suspensions. Is this on the firm setting right no, now? No, it's just a regular Soft, setting. regular setting? Well, yeah. it's quite compliant. It's yeah, not it much different than my Cayman GTS. Maybe we won't notice until we actually hit some bumpier roads, but it's certainly very livable. I'm noticing this, the steering feels really cool. Yeah, the steering is cool. Ha, ha, ha. 
much for watching and please subscribe to Chico's Cars and I will try to bring you more amazing cars and cool car content.